Hello, my name is Lydia. Myself and Bill are demonstrating a series of activities available on the main tax portal. In this video, we're going to show you how to file a potato return. This is a logged in activity, so you must have a main tax portal username and be logged in to do this. We'll start off on the logged in homepage and we're going to select the option to view returns on the potato tax panel. We're going to select file now for the period for which we'd like to file. In this case, the period ending September 30th of 2021. First is a series of yes or no questions. Anything that is required is marked with a red asterisk. Next, we have the schedule page. At the top are a series of instructions for how you should format any attachments. And then you have the option to either upload an attachment, format it as the instructions describe, or to manually key in information into the table provided. And for the purpose of today's demonstration, we're just going to add an attachment. Once the information is uploaded, just look through and verify that everything is correct, no errors. Once you're done that, you may click next. On the next page, it is calculated the total pounds received, sold, or shipped based on the information contained in our attachment. It is also calculated the tax due And on the next page, it gives us the option to make a payment for that amount due. We're going to say yes. We'll be asked to choose our payment method or enter in a new one. If you choose to enter in a new one, you'll be asked for your checking or savings account, the routing number, the account number, and the account number again to confirm. You'll also be asked if you'd like to save that payment channel for future use. The payment date will default to today and the amount will default to the total. You can change either of those if you wish, and then you'll be asked to confirm the amount. On the next page, there'll be a summary of the information entered thus far. Once you confirm everything is correct, you may continue. And then you'll be asked to declare that everything is correct on your return and enter in the name of the person filing. And on the confirmation page is your confirmation number. We do encourage you to make note of this for your records. That does conclude our demonstration of how to file a potato return. Thank you all for watching.